Okay, this next one's a little bit more niche, but I do use it a lot, probably because I guess I make a lot of mistakes, but I do git, undo cs, and in my head, this stands for git, undo, commit soft, and the command that this runs behind the scenes is actually this. So it does git reset dash dash soft and then removes the late, the last commit that I did. This is just something I do a lot of, sometimes I make a commit, realize I actually want to tack on something else. And so I'll just kind of undo it really quick and then add it back. So git undo CS, that's just, like I said, the naming that stuck in my head, but super handy to just undo the last commit uh, that I haven't pushed to remote yet. The next two are going to be pretty similar, but one is git stash L. I don't have any stashes here, but that's just, yeah, a, a an alias for git stash list. And then I also have a git stash M. And then this allows me to make a stash and then apply a message. So same, this is a similar command as git stash uh, mm -hmm. push dash M. Next on the list is git abort, which as you can probably tell, it's just an alias for git merge. That's just a bore. If I'm resolving merge conflicts or something and I'm kind of like, oh, let me start over. I just would do git abort. And last on the list is one that I call git push dash uom, which in my mind correlates to git push uh, dash u origin main. So what this actually does is it runs this command and this runs git push dash u origin and then takes the current branch that you're on. So I typically use this when I'm been working on a feature branch for a while and I'm ready to push it up to GitHub to be uh, prepared for a PR. This is just a nice shortcut that I do. If uh, a lot of IDEs like uh, WebStorm and stuff have one that kind of does this for you, but if I'm just in the terminal here, this is just the, uh, the git push dash uom is the alias that I like to use. Hopefully you found some of these aliases to be helpful. Please share in the comments below aliases that you like to use and I'll catch you in the next one.